Hi right, guys, I'm gonna show you how to assemble Ottoman bed from IKEA. Hope you enjoyed the video. If yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel as always. It will make my day. And let's do it now. Hope you like the intro. Practical stuff now. We're gonna start to build a frame for the opening part of the Ottoman bed. It's gonna be seven long metal rails, which is gonna be joined together. One screw on each side through the rail, two on the middle, exactly the same through the rail to the joining panels and same on the other side, one on the top, two on the middle and the last one on the side and flip the frame around. This is going to be the supporting parts for the mattress. So once you open the bed, the mattress is not going to slide down. Just one screw on each side, exactly the same on the other side, find the right holes and one screw securing on the each side. On the middle we're gonna have a support, it's gonna be joining screws and supporting rail. It's four screws, four joining screws, one on the top, joined together, two on the middle, exactly the same, joining screws and one on the bottom and the, uh, the frame is done. We're gonna put it on the side for now. There's no space in the room. So we're gonna need it at the end. We can start to build the uh, bed frame. This is the side panels, two wooden plugs on the side panel. This, this slim one is the top panel, gonna be joined with the side panel. We can place the long screws, which is gonna hold the whole frame together. Secure it with the key, don't go deeper then there's like a stopper so just don't go too deep when you feel resistant just stop okay l-shaped brackets you can secure them on the side panels and on the top and bottom panel this is gonna hold the metal frame which we just built four screws for the each L-shaped bracket and the last one this is gonna be stopper it's kind of lock which is gonna lock the metal frame and you put it down we're gonna get there later okay we're gonna join the side panels this is the slim panel which is gonna join the main panel attach the screws this is the small material to don't scratch the floors just stick it and the locks place the locks four locks on each of the side panels and we can join it together find the right hole stop it all in that's how it's supposed to be and secure it the four locks exactly the same on the other side find the right holes tap it in make sure everything is stopped properly and secure it with the four locks This is the big locks, you place them on the side panels, is one on each side, so two per side panel. Don't forget to point the arrow to the right direction, that's very important, and we can start to join the bed frame. Tap it in, you're gonna get closest about two, three millimeters, then you start to twist the lock, exactly the same on the other side, arrow in the right direction. Tap it close as you can and secure the lock. A lot of questions about this one just follow what I say now and you're gonna be fine most important arrow in the right direction tap it in and secure it okay there is gonna be wooden plugs they join the front panel this is the headboard extending four long screws secure it don't go too deep just about when you feel resistance stop join it together tap it in quite hard because there's those thick wooden plugs so just push it in properly there's a plastic washer and then we secure it quite hard to get in here so 
so you need a lot of patience in this operation <laughs> okay, this one's secure just secure it with the keys okay go crazy here secure it properly the four of them okay you're gonna put the legs together it's a kind of metal legs have a small plastic under secure it with one screw through the leg and secure the leg with the four screws going straight through the leg to the side panel and the front and bottom panel it's kind of holding the whole frame together as well plus it's lifting the bed slightly up so when you are touching them have a coffee of course okay this is the slightly difficult part so just follow instructions in here it's hard to explain but it's one long screw holding the hinge it's a washer between joining screws this is just the cover for the side join it in and secure it on the top with the plastic plug attach it to the to the opening mechanism is a two plastic plugs and one screw at the end one is done this is the other one exactly the same washer on the hinge joining screw secure it with the allen key this is the side the covering side just three plastic join them together and secure it with the plastic plug attach it to the opening mechanism exactly the same second uh, plastic plug and a screw at the end Okay, we have them ready now we can start to put the screws on the side panel we're gonna attach them on the side panel now secure it firmly and attach it with the long screw the stick washer between and attach it to the screw secure it don't go completely in leave about millimeter or two exactly the same here long screw big washer and secure it We secure the hinge on the bottom side, washer, long screw, straight in, and five screws securing the whole thing to the side frame. Other side exactly the same, long screw through the whole washer and attach it. Same at the end on the other side. Secure the hinge, this washer and the long screws go into the side panel, secure it and five screws securing the whole things to the side panel. Secure it, now you can attach it all firmly and that's it, the extending mechanism is done. Here I would suggest two people for this unless you know exactly what you're doing is quite heavy the frame so we attach the frame to the extending mechanism there is going to be six long screws going through the frame to the extending mechanism just attach it firmly secure at least three screws and then you can uh, let it go and attach the rest make sure this is attached properly important part this is gonna lift the whole thing up sometimes the mattresses are very thick this is the lock which is gonna be at the end so once you press it in it's gonna stay in it's two joining screws the locking thing secure it just pull the string and it's gonna open up okay wooden slats just two plastics on each side here I'm gonna go fast Tap it all in. And the frame is ready. This is the last thing. At the bottom three parts. Just cover the carpet, the floor, whatever you have under it. And the bed is done. Okay guys, and this is it. This is the Manum Ottoman bed from IKEA. If you enjoyed the video, yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel as always. Don't forget, you will make my day and see you in my next one very, very soon. Have a beautiful day.